Hello and welcome to this episode of Vasi Likey Comic Book Reviews. I'm your host Vasilis Salianis and here we are going to talk about a storyline that I've been looking forward to and it's it's getting really really cool and that's Sins Rising. We have this issue right here, Amazing Spider-Man issue number 44. We're going to review this and also the Sins Prelude. So let's get started. So Peter Parker is dreaming crazily. He's having some weird nightmares. He dreams he is Spider-Man and he's in the back seat with a character named Overdrive who can uh, use any kind of vehicle. Like so like if there's something that he that he wants that he wants to use, he, uh, he can make it a vehicle. And he and he's riding in the back seat with Overdrive uh, and he's riding like a bat out of hell, just going crazy and Spider-Man doesn't know why. You want to be in this you want to be in this video? So we had a little interruption here. Uh, K9 wanted to be in this video, and then uh, you could tell that he's a Spider-Man fan right here. Are you ready, K9, to uh, it, it get involved in this? All right. <laughs> Overdrive had a heist that went terribly wrong with the demons, and now the long-lost Sin Eater goes and kills every single person. What? Sin Eater? We haven't seen him in so long, and uh, I'm excited about this guy because uh, I have we ha we haven't really seen him since the '80s, and now he's back, and we don't know why. But something is wrong with the Sin Eater. He is looking crazy. He, he for some reason he looks like almost like a carnage. Like he just slaughters every single demon there. And Overdrive uh, escapes and get and and somehow Spider-Man is in the backseat. But of course, this is a dream. So, uh, but I think also it might even be a little bit of a reality as well. I'm not sure exactly what's going on in the timeline between if the dream is a dream or reality. Who knows? So the Sin Eater finally catches up with Overdrive and Spider-Man, and uh, kills Overdrive and is about to kill Spider-Man, and then he wakes up. <gasps> Or so he thinks. Are you very interested in this, buddy? Are you very interested? Yeah? Right. He thinks he's woken up. He starts calling his ex-wife, Mary Jane, who he hasn't been married to for a, for a while now. And um, he, you know, he wants to try and get back together. But as he's doing this message, he starts choking and starts throwing up like bugs and all kinds of weird stuff, bile and bugs. And he just went, ugh, ugh, ugh. it's really weird how it, how it happens. And he starts getting uh, sucked into this dust. We find out that there's this mysterious man who, uh, who we do not know who he is, but he's behind his dreams. But in his waking life, this mysterious man has plans for Peter Parker and Spider-Man. So the next issue we want to review is the Sins Rising comic book. And uh, this is a one-shot from, from Amazing Spider-Man. And this is uh, pretty wild. It's basically the origin of the Sin Eater. And he has a pretty jacked up history uh, in his life. So we find out about Stanley Carter and his, his transformation into Sin Eater. His mom was a drug addict, his dad got killed, and his mom puts him away to their, to their grandparents, live in the Ozarks. And while he was a kid, one of his grandparents was a preacher, and you know, they did all the snake stuff, you know, the, ooh, you know, those kind of churches that, you know, they had the, the snake charmers and all that stuff. And while this was happening, Stanley Carter learns the ways of the Sin Eater, a, 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 a which is a, is a ghostly entity. But the Sin Eaters are the ones that uh, they consume their sins uh, when they die, so that way they can go to their, you know, the the better afterlife. It's it's really like sickening uh, how like he does because this is like a little kid. He sees this like he sees this this ghostly apparition. Also, like he doesn't like really twitch about it. He is more like fascinated, I'd say, when he's what uh, uh, into what he's watching. And so, you know, getting grown up, he becomes a detective, and uh, he creates this kind of persona called the Sin Eater, uh, which he basically kills kills anybody who is basically sinning. And but the thing is, though, is that 
Stanley doesn't know that you know that what the sin eater is doing. Kind of like I don't know if he like really blacks out or what, but and you, you just he doesn't know what he's doing, but then he knows the aftermath of what happened. You should like it. You love Spider-Man. You told me. You told me in confidence. And this all leads to uh, the story that happened in the 80s, which I remember reading a long time ago. So back in the 80s, Spider-Man stopped his killing spree. And it stopped uh, in the storyline, Who Killed Gene DeWolf? And what happens is, the cops kill him. He has he has a gun, he's about to shoot everybody. The cops shoot him, but they, fi they find out that there was no shells in, in, the, in the bullet. Like, I think, in his mind, I think that Stanley wanted to kill himself. Because of what the Sin, e the sin Eater has done. But now our mystery man that we found out in last issue has come to resurrect him and for what purpose we do not know so we got a message here from amkm comics today is the day the sale of the three jokers that is going to be coming out 9 p.m pacific time and at that time you can enter to win these three statues Batman statue, a Catwoman statue, Harley Quinn statue, and some giveaways that, that, that you can be entered in to win. All you have to do is buy the three Jokers today, 9 p.m. Pacific time. And this uh, drawing will go all the way till Wednesday, the 26th at 9 p.m. Pacific time as well. So you have all that time to enter to win these prizes. And also, if you really want to get a little discount use VA productions you can get 10% off your whole purchase so if you want to buy the three jokers and you want to buy some stuff on the side maybe for your lady who knows get that VA productions 10% off code and you will be prepared VA productions 10% off amkmcomics.com check it out uh, this is me, Vasilis Alianis, and uh, our co-host here, uh, Mr. K9. And if you like this video, please like it. Please like it for this puppy. And subscribe. You know, enrich your life. Maybe you're like, uh, maybe I want to know stuff about uh, Spider-Man. Well, guess what? You come to the right place, my friend. And thank you again for watching this episode of Vasilaki Comic Book Reviews. Thanks again. Peace.